Barak for Yahweh, Barak for Yahushai. Barak for Yahweh, Barak for Yahushai. Barak for Yahweh, Barak for Yahushai. I like to give all praise, honor, and infinite glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahushai. Bahashim, Rekakadash. Yahweh is the name of the Heavenly Father, who the world calls God, and Yahweh is the name of His only begotten Son who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. I like to give double honors to apostles and elders of great millstone that rule well for preaching the 100% truth in season and out of season according to the Most High's will, teaching the correct doctrine, all right? Preaching it, all right, to the best of their ability, okay, giving up their bodies, as a living sacrifice for the most high's sake, which is the reasonable service. Double honors goes out to you. I'd like to say shalom to the elect of the nation of Israel. Starting off with the 144,000, the house of David, the prophets, as well as the one third of all Israelites who will receive salvation all around the globe. You, the nation of Israel consists of you so-called Blacks, so-called Hispanics, so-called Native Americans, all right? As well as you as like foreigners who may not have a typical look of a so-called Black, Hispanic, or Native American. You may look like a average day Chinese, average day Arab, average day um, white man, okay? But, right, your lineage goes back to his white man through your father, your father's lineage okay and your spirit bears witness that you are Israelite so your spirit is proof it's evidence that you are Israelite because you can accept the hundred percent word all right the gospel the hundred percent doctrine comes out of the camp of great millstone and you accept it in full all right and you're drawn to it no doubt about it okay and you fit the curses of Deuteronomy the 20th chapter and you believe all right you believe in this truth, all right? You're for it, okay? And the Spirit, all right, from the Most High revealed that you are Israelite, okay? I like to give more praises to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahushai, Bahashim, Rekakadash, for allowing me to do another video to the Holy Spirit. This video is going to be a rebuke video on ISUPK, okay? A wicked false prophet is like group, all right, one of many, all right. And on this particular video, it says ISUPK says get vaccinated, all right. And you got this guy here, all right. And I'm gonna just play what he says and get some precepts. Lord willing, it's edifying, all right. Yeah, y'all heard about that. Y'all heard measles done came back, right? Now, uh, who has been in one of these classes before? I've given this breakdown on, on vaccinations before for years. Who has heard any class that we have taught in the UPK about vaccinations? So he's talking about vaccinations, right? Going to the doctor, all right, getting a vaccine. Okay, the doctor um, puts that needle in you, okay, punctures a needle inside of you. All right, so you can get a vaccine, all right? A so-called cure for that certain disease, okay? So he's talking about vaccines. The dog, Captain. Get vaccinated. Now, Heard what he just said? He just said, get vaccinated. How many years have I said? Get vaccinated. Now, how many years have I said that? This is when I said it, back when measles were gone. The measles were not here. But you so goddamn dumb, and you got the internet put on, on your home, in your home, and you got a phone with Facebook in it, so your stupid behind went out and didn't get your kids vaccinated. You see? He said, didn't get your kids vaccinated. So he's basically saying, you're supposed to get your kids vaccinated. All right? You're supposed to get... A vaccine. You're supposed to go to these um, 
doctors, all right? These Edomite men, Edomite women, okay? Trust, you're supposed to trust in America's vaccine. You're supposed to trust in Babylon the Great's vaccine, their cures, all right? You're, you're supposed to trust in these Edomites' cures. That's what he's saying, all right? That's completely against the scriptures. So let's get straight to the point, all right? Because get, getting vaccines or getting vaccinated, taking a needle and puncturing it inside your flesh, okay, is against the law, all right? This is Leviticus chapter 19 and verse 28. Ye shall not make any cuttings in your flesh for the dead, nor print any marks upon you. I am the Lord. Okay. So you puncturing in your flesh. All right. The most size against that. All right. You getting tattoos. All right. You um, carving inside your flesh. All right. Making imprints for the dead. The most size against that. All right. You. Um. Uh, um, taking um, just basically taking like a, a uh, dagger and you puncturing your flesh, all right, to put some um, weird things inside of you. The most size against that, all right. The most size against that, all right. Getting vaccines, okay. Of course, when we were not in the truth, right. When we were lost in this world, all right. We didn't know no better, all right. We were lost, okay. But now in the truth. All right, getting vaccines, trusting in this Edomite, this Edomite doctor's cures, all right, whatever they push out is against the Most High. You're supposed to trust in the Most High, all right. You're supposed to take the natural remedies of curing whatever um, whatever ailment you have, right. You're supposed to pray to the Most High and take natural remedies, okay. Not trusting these Edomite doctors. Getting vaccines, right? Giving your kids vaccines. So this man, all right, the ISUPK is a false, wicked, is like group, all right? They're leading people to destruction, all right? They're leading people away from the Most High, not to the Most High, away from the Most High, all right? So, okay, if you, if you're just listening to ISUPCK, it's like an ISUPK, all right, for Israelite information, okay, stay away from these guys, all right, because they're wicked. Right, they're the house of Saul through the spirit, okay? Because they're the characteristics they're doing, all right, is the house of Saul characteristics, all right? And the Most High said there's gonna be false prophets during the last days as a sign that the Lord is soon gonna come, okay? So false prophet, prophets teaching false doctrines, all right? Leading people astray from the Most High, okay? So there's gonna be multiple. Um, faiths to walk in, doors you can enter, all right? But this will be 100% truth, all right? And that's going to be revealed soon. The most I'm literally going to reveal who his chosen are, all right? Who've been laboring in the faith. This is First John 4 and 1. Beloved, believe not every spirit, but try the spirits, whether they are of Yahweh. Because many false prophets are gone out into the world. You heard that? Let's read it again. Beloved, believe not every spirit, but try the spirits, whether they are of Yahweh. Because many false prophets are gone out into the world. All right, false prophet. Okay, being a prophet, all right, you're basically saying something before it happens. Okay, and you can be a false prophet. Okay. You can be leading people to um, destruction away from the Most High, okay? Of course, you can be teaching them they're Israelite, okay? Teaching them that utter chaos is about to break loose in America, okay? That That's a prophecy that's going to come true. Utter chaos is going to break loose, all right? But you're still a false prophet because you're not teaching the 100% truth, all right? You're leading people astray, all right? ISUPK, they say Christ and God, Okay? They're false prophets, okay? I'm not saying every single individual is going to get destroyed who enter the ranks of ISUPK, all right? Because the Most High does allow you to repent and change, all right? But of course, right, their their um, rhetoric, their doctrine is false, okay? They say John the Baptist was not in the truth, right, because he didn't follow the Lord. But the Most High didn't have him, 
Okay, that wasn't his uh, um, lot to follow the Lord. His lot was to pave the way, all right? Lay the foundation for the Lord, okay? That was his lot, okay? And now they're saying get vaccinated. So these guys, too, the Spirit has been being, the Spirit has been on these guys. To um, The Most High has been putting the Spirit to reveal these guys as false, wicked dudes, all right? Commanding General Yohanna, all right? Like he's, like he's over King David, or he is King David, all right? He's second only to Christ, all right? Who's Christ, all right? Like, these guys could be paid off, all right? They could be paid off by the government, all right? To be promoting get vaccinated, to lead Israelites to being, to be, um, to break the law of the Most High, all right? So if they're saying getting, get vaccinated now, do you really think they're going to deny the RFID chip, all right? When that, when the, when Esau is pushing out the chip, all right, do you think these guys, ISUPK, are going to be like, uh, you shouldn't get this chip, all right? Uh, uh, we don't know. No, Through the spirit, the most I can have them say, get this chip, all right? It's good for you, all right? It will help you during severe times. But it's not the mark of the beast, so you can get this chip. That's what, that's what the most I may put the spirit for them to do. All right, but the chip is the mark of the beast, the RFID microchip. The radio frequency identification chip is the mark of the beast, whether you like it or not, and it will be revealed soon. All right, it's not sleeping with the white woman, it's not going to church on Sunday, it's not uh, um, embargo. Okay, it's the RFID microchip, radio frequency identification chip. All right. So these guys, ISUPK, all right, the spirit has been on them, okay? They were uh, um, causing, causing havoc and being chaotic, basically being brute beasts, all right, to GMS Pittsburgh, all right? When they've been preaching, GMS Pittsburgh been preaching at that spot, okay? But ISUPK came in, all right, after they already were there, okay? Like they were all big, bad goons, all right, causing havoc, being carnal. All right. Just acting like basically so-called um, basically niggas in the world just wearing all black. All right. They're basically acting like niggas in the world who know there is like that's it. All right. You're supposed to be transformed. And what they're how they act and conduct themselves are not according to the scriptures. I mean, it's plain to see that. All right. A spiritual man can judge of all things. All right. So it says, beloved, believe not every spirit, okay? But try the spirits, whether they are of Yahweh, okay? So you're not supposed to believe, all right, everything someone says at face value and just be led like a stray dog, all right? You're supposed to see what if what they're saying is according to the Bible, is according to the 100% doctrine, all right? So these guys right here, ISUPK, all right? The Most High has judgment. Okay, for them, all right, unless they don't repent, all right, to the best of your ability, all right, all right, most of judgment coming for false prophets, all right, because because if you take and add to the word of the most high, all right, actually, in fact, let's just get it, all right. So Revelation chapter 22 and verse 18. For I testify unto every man that heareth the words of the prophecy of this book. All right. If any man shall add unto these things, Yahweh shall add unto him the plagues that are written in this book. All right. So if you add on to this, on to the, um, what the most high's word is, right? You make up your own doctrines, your own big breakdowns, right? You add things to make, you add your own personal um style to the word, so you can um seem like you're a smart guru, right? Like you know all things, okay? That's that. That's a prideful spirit, okay? And the most high is gonna add the plagues that are written in this book, all right, to you. It says, if any man shall take away from the words of the book of this prophecy, Yahweh shall take away his part out of the book of life and out of the holy city 
and from the things which are written in this book. All right, so straight to the point. Okay. Matthew 24 and verse 4. These are signs the Lord gave the Lord Yahweh Shai, not Christ. Okay. The Lord Yahweh Shai gave to his disciples. All right. These are signs and indicators that will indicate when the Lord's coming would be to restore. All right. To, to bring um, the kingdom of the kingdom of Yasharala. All right. And to bring, take down the, um, and the rulership of the Edomites. All right. So these are signs. All right. Of the end of the age. And Yahweh shall answer and send to them, Take heed that no man deceive you. For many shall come in my name, saying, I am the anointed, and shall deceive many. So many people are going to come saying they're anointed, saying they have the truth, saying believe in our way. Okay, we got the light. All right. And shall deceive many. All right. Deceive you, lead you down a bad path. Okay, not the right path, okay, the wrong path. That's what ISUPK is doing. And the spirit has been on. The most I've been revealing these guys, right? Because these guys, all right, they, they, were, they we're, the spirit has already revealed that they're wicked and they're false prophets. But the spirit has been heavy on them with their John the Baptist, all right, nonsense, okay? And now, now they're saying get vaccinated, okay? Matthew 7 and 15. Beware of false prophets which come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly they are rav ravening wolves. All right. So false prophets. Okay. These guys may look appealing. All right. They may they may wear nice outfits. All right. They got the uh, um the um the uh slock here. All the armor, all right. They got the spikes on, okay. They may talk with a microphone. Okay, they may be screaming, hollering like um they're um like they're um in the like they're like they're soldiers for the Lord, all right. Okay, but they're in the are ravening wolves, all right. They're gonna deceive you, okay, they're gonna lead you down a wrong path. For so so for new Israelites, all right, of course, stay away from this wicked ISUPK. Your doctrine's um not the hundred percent doctrine, all right. Of course, they teach you you're Israelite, but there's more to learning that you're just Israelite. You need to know the RFID microchip is the mark of the beast. You need to know the Mosai's name, Yahweh, and his son's name is Yahweh Shai. All right? His, the father's name is Yahweh, and his son's name is Yahweh Shai. All right? All right, so Lord willing, this video is edifying. ISUPK are bugged out. All right? They're wicked. They're false prophets. All right, unless they don't repent, the most is going to destroy them brutally. All right, and don't get vaccinated. All right, don't go to Egypt for help. Don't trust in the Edomite rulership. All right, don't trust in the oppressor. All right, envy not the oppressor and choose none of his ways. All right, trust in the most high, the Lord. All right, because through thick and thin, he'll get you through this. He'll get you through all these trials, all right, if you believe and do what he wants you to do, all right, take on the characteristics of the elect. You need to get no vaccine, all right, and damn well, the last thing on planet Earth you want to get is the RFID microchip, all right. So, Lord willing, is edifying. I'd like to give all praise, honor, and infinite glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashim Yoshai, Ba'ashim Rakakadash, other peril and calamity to America, and shalom to the elect of the nation of Israel. Yasharallah. Shalom.